it's me, YD28. Welcome back to my channel, The Sims 2. Let's play Belladonna Cove Round 3. And we are back with our very first household, Carlos Contender, where today we're getting married. We're going to get married to Jessica Peterson. We um, got engaged last part, and um, the two of them are just like, you know, really they're wanting to get married and I know Carlos he's been kind of like oh, should I shouldn't I but Jessica's been like begging and begging and begging and Carlos is kind of the type of guy where he'll just be like sure it's not exactly what he wants but it's also something he doesn't really he just doesn't really care one way or the other so he's like sure let's go ahead and get married Let's do it. So I bought all the stuff. We have all our air. Oh, those balloons broke. Um, we got all our stuff over here. We got the buffet table. All we have to do and the cake. All we have to do now is throw the party. God damn it. So we're going to go ahead and do that right now. And I don't know what's going to happen. Why does it only say seven guests maximum? No. That's not right. Oh my god, hang on. Alrighty, I fixed it, and now everyone is coming. So I'm gonna have him change into his formal wear, which I believe is a tux of some kind. Ooh. Okay, let's change him up. Try for a different one. So I've invited, oh there we go. This one's a better one for him to wear. Okay, cool. Uh, and then we'll come over, serve up the food, and hire a mixologist, I think. Can I not do that? How do I do this? I want to hire a mixologist called service. Um, I've invited a lot of people, so I might be lagging a little bit. And so we know, because I have, I'm going to just pause for a second so we can look at who's all here. I've also invited Kimberly Cordial. I invited Anna Patel, who's going to pop any second. And we've got Jessica, who's in her everyday wear for whatever reason. I also have um, Chastity here. Oh, Chastity here, who we're also in love with. Um, so because of that, I went ahead and I downloaded a mod. It's called the No Jealousy mod or the Polygamy mod. And it's this item right here. It's a wall decoration and you click it and you can disable or enable Jealousy. So Jealousy is disabled on this entire lot right now. So he can do romantic interactions and no one will like freak out and um, slap his face. Now, uh, Chastity and him have this furious relationship because he caught Chastity on a date with Jeff Rutherford. Um, so, yeah. Oh my god, kids are crying and screaming and stuff. Um, Sophia is chasing Marcus, I think. They're playing tag or she's tormenting him. Oh, she's tormenting him. That's so funny. Um, but we have a ton of people here. We also invited Tara DeBato and Armand DeBato because um, I wanted to. <laughs> cool. So we're going to go ahead and do that and invite over the mixologist. We're going to grab a plate of turkey and start eating. And then, of course, we'll make the rounds of, you know, meeting everyone and talking to them and such. I don't know why Jessica's not in a dress. She is the freaking bride. So I don't know what's up with that. Someone's being mean to her for whatever reason, too. Kimberly's glowing gorgeous as ever. Did he get fat? No, he's fit. I don't know what's going on. Um, people should come and eat shortly. I don't know. I feel like I should block the fridge. Okay, let's, let's actually do that. I'm going to block the fridge with um, maybe a statue. <laughs> I just don't want people eating my goddamn food, you know? I'm just going to put that heart in front of it. And I think they won't be able to eat in front of the fridge anymore. Tons of people on this lot. Um, he wants to be friends with Jeff Rutherford, so I'm going to make sure that he, he talks to him. But... We're going to go ahead and actually get... Oh, who's fighting? Oh, oh yeah, Armand and Jessica. Oh, my God, how could I forget? <laughs> oh, my God, they're freaking fighting. 
Oh my god, that's so funny. He must be so pissed off right now. He must be so pissed off. <laughs> I invited him without even thinking about it. Oh my god. That is so... Just let me collect my... And I'll just stay out of your way. <laughs> oh my goodness, they're so funny. Jeez. Okay, we're gonna come get married and hopefully everyone comes outside to watch us yeah okay they're all coming wonderful wonderful who are you why is my bartender wearing a goddamn santa claus outfit like what only in the sims only in the sims oh there we go she's wearing a nice black dress sure Yeah, I think everyone's sitting. Anna looks humongous. My god. Okay, is everyone coming? These guys are playing freaking kicky bag. Kimberly's playing darts. Ibsen. Oh god, the fence is in the way. Oh my god, am I not gonna get any good shots because of this goddamn fence? Oh my god, what is this? This looks terrible. Yeah, gorgeous. Freaking gorgeous. I'm gonna have to get a new new shot. Okay, well, we um, got married. There we go. Oh my god, she wants to have a baby. What? Oh my god, you guys thought that too. They're like, oh my god, she probably wants to get pregnant as soon as... Um, as soon as she gets married to Carlos. And she does. She wants a freaking baby. She just married a rich sim. Got married to Carlos, a rich sim. It's true that love is all you need, but a rich spouse sure makes marriage easier. Um, so now he's coming to, he's going to congratulate her. She wants to eat. Um, freaking crazy. Uh, let's come grab a plate of turkey and we're just going to chill for a little bit. And then I also bought fireworks. So we're going to put out some, or put up some fireworks, um, after the sun sets. Uh, I'm going to have him come over and chat with Jeff Rutherford because he wants to be friends with him really bad. And right now we have a negative-ish relationship with him because we saw him um, dating dating uh, Chastity Gear. Apparently Anna Patel's leaving. See you later. Why are you leaving? I'll tell him a joke. Let's uh, chat some more and we'll talk about our fitness hobby. Jessica, on the other hand, so who do we have? We are in, I think we only have... We only have Carlos as a lover right now, but she also wants to get closer with Jeff Rutherford. She's looking to the future. She also kind of has her eye on Benjamin Baldwin. So we will talk to him. Also, there's Nathan Gavigan, which I think could be really, really interesting. And then her and Armand are like 100% not talking to each other. Um, and then we want to talk with Tara some more because we promised... Um, uh, also, she promised um, we have to get to know... Jeff Rutherford because we promised Tara that we would help her talk to her biological father so we gonna get on that Marissa Cleveland oh my god apparently we're all talking about how hot Benjamin Baldwin is I mean like true but like <laughs> isn't that a little awkward me standing right there uh Ramir Patel and Chastity Gear are chatting well that seems to be going well um, and then he wants to influence someone to talk to someone else. We can do that. Let's influence him to talk to... Um, we'll influence him to talk to Jessica, I guess, because we want that as well. And then, oh god, we need to cut the cake. Look at his face! <laughs> what is wrong his face? Are you coming to... Can we cut the cake? Cut the cake. Come on, I'd like to... I'd like to cut the cake. Come on, Jessica. Hurry before the party ends. Hang on, let me get a good picture of this. Oh, 
And of course Kimberly's like photobombing right now. Of course. Okay, cool. So she talked to Jeff Rutherford a little bit, right? Okay, cool. We have a bit of a relationship and she is attracted to him. So we are, of course, going to move on that. Um, so our party was a roof a razor rounding success. Um, pretty good. I think we're going to go ahead and dismiss the bartender as well. Everyone's leaving. So bye, 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 bye. And, oh my god, it would be so... Armand would be so mad that she got pregnant with Carlos instead of with him when, like, she left him. The entire reason she left him was because she didn't want a child. So we're going to go ahead and try for our baby. I don't know if we're going to get pregnant right away because he's older. Oh, my God, I can't believe this. But she wants a baby. Like, what, what are we going to do? <laughs> it's a want. I go with the wants. Plus, you guys, uh, you guys all kind of want this, too. So it kind of works out. Holy Jesus. <gasps> oh, oh, she jelly. I mean, she preggy. Tying the knot was sweet all on its own, but having a blowout shindig turned into a real awesome thing. Okay, don't sleep right now. It's only nine o'clock. Come and answer the phone. Why is, um, Laszlo... <laughs> I was like, who the heck is this guy? Um, okay, cool. So we are... We're officially pregnant, and... Oh my god, her carpool's here? Oh my god, she's gotta go to work? No, 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 we, we don't have to work anymore. We married a rich sim. Hi, we're quitting our job. <laughs> Just the whole reason we married him was so that we didn't have to work. Like, what? <laughs> we're quitting our job, of course. What the heck? Plus, she wants to be a criminal mastermind. Like, hi. She also wants to buy a car. And I believe we do have a maid coming in tomorrow to clean up all of this stuff that's, like, in our way. Um, but tomorrow, Jessica will definitely be going to buy a ton of clothes for herself. She's probably going to buy, like, all of the clothes, as much clothing as possible. Carlos is going back to bed because he's an old person. It's 11 p.m. Um... Actually, they're both going to go to bed. And I'm going to go ahead and skip until morning time. So we'll see you guys then. And good morning, everyone. So we just got ourselves a brand new smacking beautiful car. Uh, Jessica wanted to buy this car in red. And, you know, who is Carlos to say no? And you can see I bought that car for her or Carlos bought the car for her. And she immediately wants to reward him in air quotations with talking to him and giving him a back rub and all that delicious lovely stuff um which is you know pretty great he's working out right now upstairs um just having his alone time in the morning he likes to work out in the morning go swimming jogging work out upstairs that sort of thing and, um, you know, that that's totally fine. Jessica also made cereal for them, and it's already gone bad. Um, I can't remember if I hired a gardener. I did. The gardener will come and clean up everything. That is wonderful. So she's getting the alarm installed, and then we're going to head over to the, um, the clothing store. And I think Carlos will go with her. Um, I think it would be a very, very cute thing for the two of them to go shopping together and buy all this stuff. And, um, yeah, so she's just going to come in quickly and, and, um, share interests with him, give him a back rub. Give him a back rub. Hi. And, um, share interests very quickly. Oh, is Armand here? He keeps running by. Oh my god. Ask to leave. Is he stealing my stuff? He keeps stealing our newspapers. I don't get it. Uh, and then we want to flirt with him. I think we'll caress him to thank him for everything. She's feeling super hungry again though. So we need... It's still morning time. It's still only breakfast time. 
Uh, she's just going to make herself some cereal really quickly. Well, of course she's hungry. She's pregnant. Hi. So eat a bowl of cereal, and then we're going to go somewhere. Uh, the owner is going to be Jessica. Okay, come on. Come on, guys. I know. You need to puke. Yeah, we're going to take Carlos with us, too. And we're going to go to the the fancy phrase. Adorn yourself as a goddess. Our selection is infinitely large as the heavens. Yeah, that's where we're going. Oh, why is her comfort all the way down? Oh, no. Is she going to have a miscarriage? Oh, my God. Wait a second. Come lounge. Never mind. Oh my god, I'm so worried. Oh my god. Yeah, she needs to chill for a sec. Sorry. <laughs> we were gonna go, but she's like feeling so, so sick right now. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. We'll have to go, we'll have to go a little later to buy some clothes, which is totally fine. Uh, who can we chat with? I'm gonna have him work on his relationship with Joff Rutherford. I think the two of them are an interesting... Ooh, Jeff also wants to be friends with him because Carlos could loan him some money, which would be really, really great. Because <laughs> Jeff needs some money to buy his club, right? Are you farting? I don't know what's going on. Okay, we we're, we seem to be doing a little better, but we're now tired, so oh my god. This whole mod with the... With the miscarriage opportunities. Are, it's just frightening. It's frightening to me. Frightening. We'll have to, we might have to go next time to buy her clothes. Which is not a big deal. I don't really like mind about that. Um, but um, I think this evening we're going to invite over Jeff. I'm going to just try inviting him. No, he's not available. I want to invite him over because Jessica also has expressed interest. No, we don't want to hang out. Uh, Jessica has also expressed interest in being closer, becoming closer with Jeff Rutherford. And Carlos, you know, he wants to be friends with him. Car like, all the rich Sims want to be friendly with one another because they're in the same social circle. And so, yes, we want to invite him over for dinner and the such. So we're going to invite him over. Not Connor Weir. We don't really care about Connor Weir. Um, mm -hmm. seems I have to call a repair person as well. What's Me going on? And, um, and then Jessica will go ahead and serve up some mac and cheese for them. Do I have a burglar alarm? I do. Okay, good. And just, <laughs> you can see Jeff eyeing the car. He's like, ooh, that's a nice looking car. Let's come greet him. Invite him inside. Um, go here, and we're going to gossip with him, entertain him. <laughs> and then we're going to have Jessica come. Can you invite him to the meal? Call guest to meal, and then we'll come and eat as well. Oh, he's eating that one. Okay, fine. Very well. And there you go, Jessica. You can talk to him. What an opportunity. Look at him. He's like, yo, I aged up. I... Hmm. Just chewing together. Look at her talking about aging up and stuff. Ooh, why is there... Okay, working it up. Working it up. We're getting there. We're getting there. I think this will this will work out, and then she can tell her she's trying to like uh, get to know him. Like, oh, how was your childhood? What high school did you go to? Um, did you have many girlfriends? Sort of thing. And Carlos is like, yes, tell me about all the all the girls you've got, all the girls you had, um, and all that stuff. All right. So, uh, oh, clean up that cake. Put away the leftovers. We'll have to wait until he's done eating. Um, let's see if we can give him a friendly hug. Oh, we can. Who's running away with... Is it Armand? Yeah, it's freaking Armand again. Um, and joke, admire him, charm him a little bit, because uh, Carlos won't really care. Carlos doesn't really care. He's going to actually clean up these bowls and... Um, 
And what does he want to do? He wants to play with the Jeff. That's a fine one. We do a punchy punch me. Seems like a manly contest. And Jeff's like, okay, cool. So Carlos is, uh, he's actually just going to head to bed. He's like, whatever. Uh, Jessica, on the other hand, is going to continue getting closer to Jeff. Um, do another hug, do some more flirting, tell him another joke, admire him, and see if we can talk and gossip, um, about something. Yeah, they're getting along fabulously. But we want to know the most interesting thing. Let's see if we can answer the... F oh, oh, our belly. Woohoo! One belly. So make sure to leave um, baby name suggestions down below. I want to know. Oh, we're gossiping about Carlos and not becoming best friends with. Oh, because him and Chastity found each other. Who the hell are you? Um, gossip about. Um, she's trying to get information about their his past relationship, right? Uh. <laughs> They don't really seem to be doing that. So she's going to give him a kiss. No, we're going to say goodbye to him. It looks like we need to it looks like we need to go to bed. So let's go ahead and say goodbye to him. Um, I think she's really found out a lot. And she's going to just very quickly call. Oh, never mind. She's going to bed. I wanted her to call Tara and talk to her and tell her, you know, I found out some info for you. Um, but that is fine. I think Tara can talk to her in the next part. Um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this part here. If you guys are enjoying the series, do give this video a fat thumbs up. Subscribe for more as I put them out fairly regularly. Let me know your thoughts and comments down below about um, the household and how you think these two and their marriage is going to fare. Um, it could be quite interesting. Leave baby name suggestions down below, as I said, for Jessica's baby. How do you think Armand's going to feel when he finds out that uh, Jessica's pregnant with Carlos Contender's baby? Do you think he's going to ask her back? Uh, let me know your thoughts. I love you guys so, so very much. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.